Uh, I am very pleased to be signing this memorandum of understanding. This agreement uh, is much more than a piece of paper. Uh, we commit to implement concrete actions in the three countries, Kenya, Tanzania, and Ethiopia, as a first step. We are planning to enlarge the countries. The next step, uh, we have been discussing some possibilities uh, a few moments ago. Uh, and uh, we will dedicate especially to the fight against hunger, promoting family farm. Uh, we are talking about uh, uh, concrete actions in the field. We are talking about sharing our knowledge, sharing our expertise, so we can learn from each other. We are two different organizations. We never have been working together, but we are committed to, <clears throat> and to advocacy for uh, the poor and especially for <coughs> family farmers that are among the hungry people in Africa. Unfortunately, most of the hungry people in Africa come from the family farm sector because they are subsistence farmers. They cannot produce even enough for their own family. So what we try to do is speak for them as the poor and the hungry usually don't speak for themselves. Yeah, we are working in uh, about 25 countries in rural areas supporting saving and credit uh, unions and uh, also farmer producers organizations to contribute to the food security uh, and we can talk about very concrete proposals in for instance in cocoa, in vegetables, in cassava, in dairy where uh, small farmers come together, establish a cooperative and uh, with support of Rabobank Foundation, especially how to organize a cooperative, uh, how to establish this cooperative, but also with financial support to make a better income and to, make, to be part of the economic system. Well, up till now, the collaboration with the FAO was more on an individual level. So, for instance, uh, Kelvin uh, Miller is a well-known person in uh, Rabobank Foundation. But I'm very happy that the uh, FIO is uh, making a big uh, change, um, and um, uh, a change in that they would like to be more uh, uh, involved and, and related to the private sector. So I'm very happy that we at Rabobank Foundation, together with the FIO, now signed the first uh, collaboration agreement. Uh, how we can support uh, with uh, regards to the, each other's competencies, each other's in the field uh, in Africa or other countries. And we're also very happy that uh, today the, we signed the memorandum of uh, understanding and it is clear from, uh, from the discussion we also had privately with the Director General, Mr. Da Silva, that he fully supports this project, which is very important. And we also understand, by the way, that our queen, uh, Prince F, uh, Queen Maxima nowadays, I still have to get used to the idea a little bit, uh, also fully supports this idea and also will twist some arms to, to make it successful, which is very important, I think, for both of us. The major challenge is to uh, find together with, with partners like FAO good partners in rural areas all over Africa who really can contribute to uh, food security to the food security agenda. Uh, and that's, I think, the, the main issue because there's a lot of, I would say, uh, dust all over. Uh, and we have to discover together what kind of initiatives we should support together. Well, I would say that um, we are after individual farmers, male and female. Organize them in cooperatives, give them access to finance. And of course, we fully understand that after that individual farmer or uh, woman is probably a family. 
So if you talk about the extended family, uh, it's not only the farmer himself, but it's maybe six, seven or eight people. So uh, we hope that with our support, eh, together with uh, FAO, we can uh, encourage them, help them, serve them, that uh, will also, uh, that, say, their entire family will benefit from it. So therefore we think that uh, putting a little bit more focus on our activities with regards to that uh, individual farmer, also the family, the entire family will be uh, part of the success. In our uh, experience uh, that we have in uh, Africa, Latin America, it's pretty clear that uh, women are very, very important in rural development uh, for all kinds of reasons. I don't have to go into that, but I think that very much coincides with uh, the, the aims of the United Nations for this winter mm -hmm. 2014. In my opinion, um, I see a, a, a change in FAO, eh? so more committed to uh, say the people on the ground, more uh, committed eh, and especially uh, empowered, I think, by, by Mr. Da Silva. Uh, to, to, to the farmer himself. Uh, so I think uh, the, the FAO can contribute with a lot of knowledge, with a lot of uh, uh, influence, with a lot of people on the ground in, 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 in the countries. We would like to start up uh, projects or are, are already active and we will add uh, experience on cooperatives and on finance uh, to that and I think together we can make, uh, we, we can make a difference.